Hey there, welcome back to another Head to Head, a competition between the two best hotels in Quito near the airport, I should say. So these are two Quito airport hotels, Quito, Ecuador, and we're going to cover the Wyndham and the Holiday Inn. Which one is better? You decide. A little spoiler alert, they're both pretty darn good, actually. But let's get into some of the details between them and uh, help you decide which one you might like to book. Okay, let's start with the Wyndham. There's that shuttle that brings you from the airport to this lovely property. You can see it was Christmas when I was doing this, and uh, it was well decorated. Let's walk on inside. This is your main lobby area with plenty of chill space uh, there, and way in back, of course, the counter's off to your left there. It's a really pretty property. So from here, you can walk on back and take a right, and you can walk down past some very lovely artwork to, of course, of some of the more important areas of any hotel, as you can see, we'll walk here towards the dining area and, of course, the bar. Now, this bar is not bad. It's stocked with some pretty good scotches and whiskey, like all of uh, Ecuador. It's missing any good rye, but it's a good bar with good bartenders, and it's got a very nice dinner and breakfast buffet. Now, let's speak at the common areas of the Holiday Inn. As you can see, it's got a wonderful entrance here. Walking in, you're going to have this huge expanse of lobby with lots of chill spaces off to the right here, counters off to your front, and of course, most importantly, the bar area, which is well stocked. It was uh, quite nice. You could eat in the bar or hang out there, and off to the right of this scene is a, where the buffet is and where you could grab dinner. There is a wonderful pool area out back. It's got a nice pool for playing and for kids, probably doing some lap swimming if you're into that. And of course, back and back there, it's got a hot tub. We didn't try it, but we hear it's quite nice. Okay, let's get down to the nuts and bolts of the uh, whole video here. So the rooms are almost identically priced. Uh, you can see I've got a 114 and 104 price uh, circled. That's for a king size standard room, including breakfast for both. Uh, Dex, of course, is more. They're both extremely comfortable and priced about the same. If you have dogs, I would say the Edge is definitely the Holiday Inn because they allow dogs of all sizes. The Wyndham does not. Uh, if you have kids that want to play around, probably the Holiday Inn again. If you want the absolute closest to the airport with a great buffet and you have certainly Wyndham points, well, the Wyndham's quite nice. You really can't go wrong with either airport, to be honest. As you can see, they're both really great. Uh, you can't go wrong with either one. Now, as I mentioned earlier, if you're bringing a dog in, I think the hands-down winner is the Holiday Inn because they allow dogs. They allow dogs of all sizes. They allowed my um, uh, 75, 80-pound dog to come down there. It's very dog-friendly. If you have a lot of kids, it might be a little bit more kid-friendly, too, with all that uh, space out there in the, around the pool for recreation. Um, I think uh, you'll have to decide for yourself. Obviously, both are nice. I hope you enjoyed this comparison and find it useful. If you do, hit the subscribe button if you want. Leave a feedback of a hotel that I missed here. I only know of these two that are really nice airport hotels. So let me know and take care, and I hope this is helpful to you. Bye.